Hi, <laughs> I'm Stan FPV, and today we're building a drone that can carry not one, but two full GoPros. Oh, did I mention it's only using little three inch props? Find out more next. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready? This is it, this is it. Here is the dual GoPro Cinewhoop that I've been filming my recent videos with. A lot of people have been asking me questions on what I'm using to build it and uh, what parts and how I'm going about getting this to work. So uh, here she is, one GoPro. Right now I'm using the Hero 4 on the back. And two GoPros, session. I think an ideal setup would be two sessions just for weight distribution. Perfect. If you look, it's about the same size as a uh, same footprint. As the Baby Hawk R three inch from last year. Little higher. This thing's pretty simple. All I did was take the X Hover B roll frame and I modified it with this baby. It's the uh, diamond file that comes with uh, any Impulse RC frame, but Perfect. I'll put a link in the description. So I took it, and as you can see on these arms, I'm not using the holes that it comes with for uh, for the motors. They use 11, 11 something motors, and that wouldn't hold a GoPro. So what I did is I just filed it out a little Perfect. bit Perfect. on all three inner radiuses. I don't know if they even knew what they did, but it fits a 14 motor, or at least these motors perfectly. So yeah, you can get three of those in there and lock it in there and it, it centers it and everything. And then you file the inner, the top of the bottom plate, inner holes of the motors where the C-clip spins and it frees it up and enables it to work. And these are the, the Rotor X and Rotor Riot Brat motors. Yep, I'm using the Lumineer uh, Micro Lux V3, but the Helio, uh, the mini board just came out, so I would use that one. Perfect. Perfect. I have links in the description also. It's an amazing tool. Amazing. Like I said, with two and a half inch props, this is what I use for inside. I use level mode on in, indoors with these two and a half inch gem fan 2540s flash props. They work very well. I got the uh, XT30 connection coming out the back and then up here with uh, one of those cap caps. This thing is pretty, pretty convenient. Makes it nice. And you can see it's just soldered on there. Yep, this just comes right out. I have it here with a uh, Millie tie 
and a angled uh, foot, Perfect. foam foot. This right here is a good good setup too. This one you could do a little acro. I'll put a video playing right now of a little bit of acro. Perfect. It's really really uh, really fun actually for some zero degree tilt little macro it puts a different perspective on it because it just slows it down but it's still super smooth so it's really cool yeah this works awesome and the indoors like i said i use the flash props outdoors i use the hq t three by three by three so in here as you can see i got the lux in there with the vibration dampening uh these these feet and then I got, I put M2 vibration dampeners in the holes of the Lux because they're M3 holes. So it actually makes them M2. Also, if somebody wanted a 3D print, just a, a guard of some sort, I don't know, that'd be cool. A guard around these would be perfect, but I really haven't came into any issue with them yet. They're not really big enough to, to rip stuff. Nope, it's an amazing tool. I have the camera tilted about five to 10 degrees and this tilted at zero. I have, oh my God, gel, the camera gel right here. This stuff is amazing. I have this stuff on everything. Full crossfire on it. Immortal T mounted back here. Um, it goes under the ESC right here, and it's the Nano is mounted right there behind the camera. Uh, I have a Unify video transmitter. I have the the V3 Pro 5G8. It's up here, going straight back to uh, at the time the the micro Axie 2 didn't exist either. So this is the big big UFL version. So you could use this one, it's fine, it works. I have it with the X-Hover uh, Axi 2 mount. But also the uh, the little micro mount, or the little micro Axi would work too. So it'd be smaller and I'm guessing less weight. Either one works. I'm using a Runcam Micro Swift 2 as a camera. It's just a simple 2.1 wide view camera. Um, I have the little dongle on it because I, I wasn't this is the first time I used this board and I wasn't sure about it So I just wanted to make sure I had a, I didn't know if it had an extra UART Which it does so I if you want if you're using this board or the helio you can go and get the uh, micro swift 3 but the the, the little version the, with the smaller lens that one weighs way less. This is uh this is the bigger one right here it's huge it's front heavy and it uh it weighs significantly more so yeah i'll go with either the micro swift 2 like this is and you'll have the dongle plug in or uh get the micro swift 3 and you'll have just a, a rxtx hookup where you could go into a uart and do it from your uh your radio which is nice the three inch props with the uh, Brat motors are very, very awesome. Like it, it's very efficient and very able to haul. So you could uh, do one GoPro, any any of them, with uh, 3S or 4S. This frame works quite well because it's compact and pretty much the smallest you can get all of this stuff in with the battery and the GoPros and everything. I'd say when you're beginning on this rig, use a, uh, a 3S around 850. And then once you get more comfortable with it, I would go up to uh, the 4S because that increases the, the flight time. And the ability to fly indoors uh, is increased with the 4S because you could use smaller props. The three inch props you could use all around. These are the best all around props for indoor and outdoor, both for one camera and two cameras. But uh, 
You can also use smaller props if you have to go through tighter gaps. The little props provide less thrust, so it, it it's more of a dampening effect. So if you have to uh, fly indoors, I would suggest until you get really comfortable with this machine, using the smaller props with uh, at first a 3S battery with one camera and then increase it to a 4S battery with two cameras with the smaller props inside. The beauty of this thing is the two camera ability outdoors also. And I got four minutes of flight time with this, this rig. So there's a lot you could do in four minutes. And that four minutes was this exact setup with this camera right here. So what I do is I just put this on its face and I stick this right in here. So there you go. There's the, the backward camera too. One camera, two cameras. Really, like here's my head. It's a little bit of my head. That's for sure. <laughs> uh, it's, it's, it's little, these are three inch props. I don't even know. <laughs> I'm just a dad trying to solve a problem, so if you guys figure out something, let me know your experiences so maybe this could become a community project and we can all make something great together as filmmakers. This is an amazing tool. Setup is simple, uh, it's completely stuck. <laughs> I don't know, follow the uh, instructions to whichever board you end up using, uh, either the Lux or the Helio or whatever 20 by 20 board you feel like using. This one had all the capabilities I need, so does the Helio and uh, everything is linked in my description. Disclaimer, this isn't super easy to fly. Um, I've been flying for about two years FPV now. Just make sure you uh, stay within your skill level and have fun. Don't hurt anybody. Do not fly around anybody until you're comfortable with your abilities. That's just, I want to get that out there. Safety disclaimer, be careful, be responsible. Don't mess this up for everybody, please. Go out there and have fun. Use this as a way for us to ease our minds and ease from stress and use it as a getaway and don't get, don't get us all in trouble. Don't make us look bad. All right, well with that, you guys, if you wanna support me, click the links below. Uh, my family would appreciate it. My daughter, my wife. If not, your decision, it's all good. Uh, it doesn't cost you anything extra. But yeah, you guys have a great day, great night. Have fun building these. If you guys have any questions, let me know. I'll be happy to help you guys. Fly like a bird, people. Perfect, perfect.